All right, guys, welcome back to some more of the Golf Club 2019. And today we are going to be doing week number 42 of the Fantasy Course of the Week. This is my first golf video since I hit 100,000 subscribers. Um, so we're going to be doing something a little bit special. I'm going to be putting my merch on sale as well. Uh, I mean, as in we're doing a special course. Apparently, Darren picked it out as like a Star Wars course. He said to look around. It's really impressive. But also, I'm going to put my merch on sale just for the people watching this video. I'm going to give you guys the code. It's going to be Apex Golf in all caps. Um, the merch is doing really well. I'm, I'm loving it. People seem to be liking it. I don't think anyone's actually got it yet, but just the designs, I mean. I think they look quite clean, uh, but they're on the way. I assume shipping might be a little bit delayed due to the coronavirus, but uh, it should be with you within a few weeks at least. Anyway, uh, you can check out the designs. I'll have them up on the screen. And um, go buy one. Use the code. Go buy one. Let me know which one you you pick up, you decide to pick up, or which design you like the most. If you don't have enough money at the moment, that's fine too. Maybe pick one up at a later stage. We're going to jump into the society event right now though and see what we can do. Last week was the Irishman's Castle. I didn't start recording. So as you can see, we came 52nd, 14 under won it. K. McKelligan and Sard 59 both got 14 under two Americans. Uh, we can't allow that to stand this week. We can't allow the Americans to win on the Irishman's castle. That's just not allowed. I'm sorry, guys, but you're both disqualified. And Grifster 74 has won. He doesn't have a nationality. He's just from the golf club. That's where he was born. All right, but got to give that course a five stars. I really did enjoy it a lot. And uh, let's jump in and try out this new course now. Hopefully the event is live because I didn't even check, but... So happy to welcome you to okay, our this coverage looks of this dope. event let's go. on the TGC Network. This looks awesome. This will be a single round event. And we are just about to get underway, so let's get down to that first team. Holy, this looks crazy, man. I'm more of a Lord of the Rings fan, but Star Wars is alright. Um, <laughs> anyway... I just want to give a huge shout out to everyone who's watched my videos along the way until 100,000 because I know some of you guys just watch the golf stuff. So if you haven't seen my 100k video or anything like that, I do just want to give a huge shout out to you guys. It really does mean the world that you guys support me so much. And um, a thank you to all the people who bought the merch as well and who will continue to do so, who will continue to support the videos, watch the videos going forward. Uh, golf has been a huge part of this channel and it's going to continue to be. Uh, for the near future. Hopefully we get a new golf game at some time in, in the near future. That will be really nice. Maybe it will be on the next generation of games before we do get a new golf game. But our next generation of consoles rather before we get a new golf game. But anyway, thank you all. Let's jump in and let's see if we can uh, if we can shoot a good score around this Star Wars course. And with that, the first drive of the event is away. And this is not looking promising. <laughs> right into the bunker. I was actually trying to hit that fast, but we now, failed. See what can be done. And that is an lie. awful lie, too. Oh, good lord, we got a bad start here, people. This is not what you want to see. All right, let's just get a par and go on to the next one. Be on our merry little way. It was kind of risky taking on that shot, trying to go over the bunkers. I was trying to hit it fast. Didn't work out. That's okay. And that lie will as long be as we get a power out of it, we'll be fine. The last one. I don't know if I can see us getting that power from here, though. What is that? Good lord. Not very good, but it worked out okay. It worked out okay, yeah, not right terrible, at least. Footmark. If you did miss my 100k video, by the way, I'd recommend checking it out. There is some golf stuff in there. I've done a 100k montage, pretty much. The name of the video is just 100,000 subscribers. Uploaded it last week. Boom! And let's go! It's a good par save par. on the first. And starting I have a feeling this is going to be a tough course, though. 4 under through 11 is leading. And uh, 7... Well, how many people? 11 people have played so far? 10 people. Okay. Let's... Uh, Let's and go. Now let's see what this second hole has in store. Oh my good. Oh my god. Yeah, there's going to be a lot of elevation and stuff like that to make this a lot more difficult, I feel like. Alright, I'm definitely hitting this. There's no way I can... Hey, you think this is still going to be too much, though? No. Should be fine. I hit the 203 just in case. The 224 would have been fine, but just wanted to be... Ultra safe. That's why I always wear two condoms. I'm just kidding, guys. But, um... 
That's not bad. And he'll be happy Good positioning. And this is a par four as well, by the way, lads. Like, really? This is a par four? Okay. That's not going to be enough, unfortunately. But, like, this is 100% going to be too much, so... Unless we hit it into the upslope. That's the only way I can see this not being too much. That was a hell of a strike. Couldn't have been better, to be quite perfectly honest. It's not going to be a great result, but it's a good strike, and it's not a bad result. It's actually not half bad. It's going to be a really tough putt up the hill. Nothing wrong with that. But it's not this awful. putt's for birdie. And it's a birdie chance. Slim pickings, but it's chance. I'd take a par. <laughs> I'd take a par, honestly, but... Oh, I didn't hit it, did I? It was actually bang on line, I just didn't hit it. It was really, and really good. For the par. Maybe it would've just went left. But, a par on the first two isn't the end of the world, they're quite difficult holes. And after that hole, he will stay at even par. Six under through 12 now. That's who we're aiming to catch, that American. Par four, folks. We need to take revenge on the Americans for what they did at Irish Man's Castle. We can't, as I said, we can't allow that to stand. You gotta take a look at this scenery, as Darren was saying, man. He told me to, like, take a second and look around, because this is beautiful. Wow. Vader's helmet, and there's the hole up there. This is, this reminds me of a proper fantasy course, you know? Like a real proper fantasy course that there isn't too many of these days. Yo, should I go down here or what? I don't even know if I should go up there or not, to be honest. I'm gonna choose not to. Although, we'll... Hmm, it's... No, I think it's risky going up there. Like, I think it's honestly a lot safer to go down. I just hit an awful golf shot. Well, so far so good for That's this That's honestly lucky to even be on the fairway there. That was so bad. It's not even going to be on the fairway. Oh my god, it is. Honestly, that's just pure luck. Because <laughs> that was and horrendous. this shot below the hole. See, maybe we should have gone for the uh, uphill one. Because then you would have a flat shot coming in. It looks like the uh, hybrid is on display here. And heading for the green. Yep, I thought that might be a little far. But and I'll take this opportunity to correct myself. Uh, it's not that bad. In the sand. Actually, it is kind of bad. It's kind of awful, actually. Like I can't see. The biggest problem I have here is I can't see my swing. It's actually a decent lie. It's downhill, so I'm gonna put some loft on this bad boy and then. Really? Come on! It got caught up there. That's some bullshit. That was actually, like, a decent shot, I thought. We have another decent putt to save par here. It breaks left at the start and breaks right at the end. I think it's fairly even, honestly, on which is... I'm just gonna hit a true, true both. And it's dead straight, and it is! Yeah, it's another par up. save! We're just saving par right now. And after that one, he'll stay at even par. Even par. We're not playing the best, but we're not, uh... All right, here's the we're not scoring hole. too badly, at least. The, it, the course is tough, like, for sure. It's definitely, it's long, it's tough. That 6 under through 12 is quite impressive, unless the holes get e easier as we go along. That is some impressive shooting. That's a zero mile an hour win, by the way. I need to take absolutely zero notice of that. Put a little bit of loft on this bad boy. And that's a and beautiful six, swing. Iron. It's a little left. A little further left than I thought it'd be, to be honest, because it was a zero mile an hour wind. I thought I hit that fairly straight. Maybe it's tugged a little bit, but... It's a birdie chance. We're not going to be struggling for par this time, at least. All right, 27 feet to the cup. 27 feet to the cup. Stay up. Oh, it's right in the middle. Let's and go. Right into the cup. I brought my putting shoes today, son. I brought my putting day. shoes. What's up? And we get under par for the first time today. Let's go. 
tied for last on the leaderboard, I just realized. Good lord. Ten people played and... Okay. Okay, let's see what the fifth has in store for us. Or currently playing, I should say. Alright, 630 yard par 5. Can we go back to back birdies? It would be nice. Oh my god, this is awful. What the hell? Why would you ever have me hitting that club anyway, at least? Yo, is this gonna be too far if I hit driver? No, there's no way it's too far. It's a there's no way it goes all the way over. There's no chance. That's a perfect shot. Don't be off the cliff. That's all I ask. And, uh, nicely done. Looking this is like a really we'll cool hole as well. Like, down a big massive cliff, but that is a beauty. 330 yards down the middle of the fairway. And it's trying to convince me not to go for this. But it's... Guys, I have to go for this, right? I think I could hit the 224, to be honest, and it would still be more than enough. It's 186 foot down, for God's sake. Honestly, this could nearly be too much. I don't know. I'm trying to think. That's all over it. What a shot! What a shot! Oh my god, we've played this hole to perfection. Very Can well you really played, believe how good that was? Par 5 and 2 is going to set up some nice eagle opportunities here. Good lord, that is good. And it's an eagle. And and what an eagle, eagle by the drops. way. 630 yards, that is. And I know it was massively downhill on both accounts. We hit two perfect shots and a perfect putt to, to follow. And uh, we jump from ninth to third in the leaderboard with an eagle there, and we're only one shot off the leader, who has now uh, been joined by an Australian. And now setting up for the par four tee off. Par four tee off. Okay. That's cool. <laughs> they got the vehicles and all, man. That's really dope. This is some well worked. Star Wars nerdy shit. You know, it's it's really well done, I must say. We can go for this, definitely. Like, 100%. But I'm worried it might be too far, if I'm being perfectly honest. That's the one worry that I have here. But I'm gonna go for it regardless, because I just made an eagle, and I don't give an F about nothing. It's 100% too far. Why did I think that was ever gonna be... No. It's actually pretty decent. It's gonna be in... The rough out the back. No, it's not because this is a massively slanted green. It's an absolute beauty again. Oh my! Could we go? Could we possibly go back to back eagles, people? And that's just inspiring. Is, is that a possibility, watch, and gentlemen? Hitting the green off the tee on what a round so far. Yes, I'm loving it. Stuff. loving it. Loving it. Loving it. Loving it like that. Do you really like it? Do you really like it? It doesn't break that much, honestly, but it does break, so... Have to make sure that we allow for some break. And it's right in the middle! The eagle it's back-to-back -back eagles! Oh my god, we're on fire. We're on fire. I, you know, I need to thank you guys for for helping me reach 100,000 subscribers. That's why I'm here. That's why I'm, I've made back-to-back -back eagles. We're five under for the last three holes, by the way. Teeing off on this Let's go! Four. All right, this is going to be... It won't reach that bunker, right? It's way uphill. No, it's actually not that far uphill. This is kind of dangerous either way, though, because, like... I don't know. I don't feel like it would be too far back if I don't hit driver. Well, this is a close one. It could be in the fairway. Don't go into the rough. That's all I ask. Just stay up on this. Yes. That's perfect. Absolutely perfect. We're on fire. I've never played better in my entire life. Star Wars, thank you. Yeah, about 110 yards to the pin. We're actually not here. that far back here. We're not as far back as I thought. We're still 52 foot up, though, so... need to be aware of that, and I'm going to hit the 136. Oh, God, that's awful. Going with a pitching wedge here. Sit. Sit! I thought it might be a little much. Nice I shot. thought it I might be a little like much, but uh, it's not too bad. 
The greens aren't like massively difficult either, which is helping us quite a lot because I've been putting the ball really well. Get in. Get in. You dirty oh, dogs! That was, that was just fun to watch. We just can't miss at the moment. And he's still tied. It's another birdie. We're six under for our last four holes. This is madness. Absolute madness. And we're six under through seven. We parred the first three. We struggle for par. But that'll show you to never give up, guys. We we really had to grind out the first few holes for pars. And now we sit atop the leaderboard. Well, we're tied with four, uh, three other people, but still, we're about to we're about to pass him out. And next on the plate is the eighth hole. Another par five. Could we? Could we? It's 582 yards. It's not as downhill as the other ones, so don't expect to be reaching this one um, in two. Need two really good shots if we want to reach this in two. I don't think we can reach this in two regardless, actually, just thinking about it now, logically. Maybe we can. Let's see. Let's see how far. Because I, I think the second shot might yeah, be uphill. nothing wrong with that shot. I'm not sure. Ooh, I think we we can. It's going to be either just in that bunker or just over and probably off the back. Like, there's no way to stop it if, if I do reach it. So I feel like either way, it's not going to be ideal. There's no way to, like, get this close if you get what I'm saying. But we'll try our best. I, I've done as good as I could possibly do here. Uh, not good. This is not going to be good. Really? Okay. It's way short. Okay. I expected it to be like trickling back into the bunker if it was going into the bunker, but because it wasn't that far uphill, was it? And now from the sand. Can't remember it being that far uphill unless I'm tripping balls. I'm tripping balls, son. About as good as it gets out of the bunker there, and that's going to be another birdie. This one's about three feet from the cup. Four and we're on fire, three. people. We really are. We're on fire. And unfortunately, he's Let's have a look at this scorecard real quick. That one. Look at that. Birdie, eagle, eagle, birdie, birdie. Wait, we fall out of first stats of that one? And How the hell does that work? I just made three. birdie. Someone must have made eagle. Oh my god, this is difficult. 144 foot down. Okay. That might be short. Mm, no, it's okay. It's pretty good. It's pretty damn good, actually. This is a hell of a par 3. Imagine we birdied this one as well. That would be insane. 288-yard par 3 with 144 well, I think feet he's gonna like of, that. Um, okay, from 30 feet out. of altitude. Okay. Breaks to the right at the start. And then breaks to the left, like, all the way. Is that all the way until the end? Yeah, it definitely breaks more to the left, but, like, it's not a massive amount either. So I'm going to go with that. I don't know if that's enough. No. It's not enough. First off, it's not hard. Well, actually, it is hard enough, but wasn't enough break. That was a decent effort. Oh, And, and it's going to be a tap-in par. Just a Our first par since the third. Very long putt. Finishes off the front nine. With a tap. At they'll get a six under. And after that one, they'll move down and in seven under third under. place on the leaderboard. Seven under. Yeah, we have we have a few holes to gain on these guys, though. And if we keep playing okay, like we are, man, we're definitely going to catch them. 509 yard par four. Oh, God. That's a decent length par far. Par far? Par far? Can't speak English. Apparently, par far. That will be just dandy, sir. Right up the right side of the fairway and give us a good angle coming in to the green. That's what I'm talking about. He's got to be pleased with that. From here, about 195 yards to the pin. 
Ooh. This I think this is just gonna be perfect. Oh damn it. I hate that. Don't like that lie at all. Don't like it at all at all. It's Going okay to though. Five iron here. And this one's looking pretty good. It is looking pretty good, isn't it? And it simply is pretty good. It's got to stop up there. Come on, come back down off the hill a little bit. Yep, keep coming. Go on, a little bit more. Pick up pace. Pick up pace. Pick up a little bit more pace. Nah, it's gonna stay there. Okay. It's not the end of the and world, obviously. That approach is safely on the green, but a uh, whole lot of work to do for that next putt. Mm, this is quite difficult. The back nine starting off tough. The front nine finished tough, and the back nine starting tough. Stay up. Stay up. Stay up. Oh, Ooh, no. Good. We've been robbed. We've been robbed. I thought that this was going in. about three feet away. We've been putting really well today. But it's not the end of the world, as I say. Not the par. It's a tough hole out of the way. We're only one day. shot back of the leader. And he's currently tied Follow the leader, leader, leader. The leaderboard. Another near 500-yard par four. For the next... This is index 16 as well. Really? How the fuck is this index 16? Look at this fairway. You joking me? Is this some sort of practical joke? This is index 16. Stay in that fairway. Don't you dare even think about going into that bunker because I'll lose my mind. Oh my god, you gotta be joking me. You've gotta be joking me! That was about as good a strike Probably as I can hit the driver dead straight. Ah, oh, that's so unfortunate, man. Really. Not a shot. It's too far, actually. No. It's way too far. It's just way too far, mate. Oh, it's gonna go. It's gonna go way down, is it? Oh, no, it's going to stay there. And he's probably going to like that. A slim birdie chance. That is for birdie. A slim birdie chance. Come on. We've been making some nice putts today. Let's keep that up. We're Oscar Mike. Sorry, I've been playing Modern Warfare 2. The remaster. Stay in. Let's go. Let's go! And from that Come light, on! Mike We're back on track. Some putt. That's a hell of a birdie from where we were as well. And after that a one, hell of a birdie from where we were. The top spot on the leaderboard out of the bunker we hit a brilliant shot to be fair five. and we got a 565 yard par 5 here the easiest hole on the course can we get our third eagle of the day possibly should I go right or left I'm gonna go right I think right is the way to go here left looks like there's more trouble left I know it's a thinner fairway down here but I've been driving the ball well doing everything well and that's an absolutely beautiful golf shot yeah, it's definitely the better angle here. to come in from this side. You have way more green to work with and a, a better angle overall. Uh, don't you dare. Don't you dare. Thank you. It's going to be an awkward shot just because of the lie, but it's, from at least it's not forty-five more. yards to the Oh, wow. Pin. It's way, way above our feet. Okay, I can't hit the. I can't hit that one. Just simply can't. It's downhill as well, so this is going to be enough. This is 100% going to be enough. Going with the hybrid here. That honestly might be too far, I'm thinking. Yeah, it is. Yeah, I was I was just thinking in my head. I think I could actually nearly hit, like, the 203, genuinely. The 203 might have been a little short, but you never know. It could have bounced well, on. Good approach this isn't there. bad, though. This is definitely... Too much club, I think. Yeah, I think the 203 would have been short. We were kind of just stuck between a rock and a hard place there. a good chip and it's going to be a birdie a little tap in birdie sure he's gonna like that one and this one's to get to nine under par right let's get double digits under par now that's the next step all right guys i wish you guys understood how fucking upset i am right now but um the recording cut out after just before my putt on the 12th hole where i puttered it in for birdie i parred 13 and 14 got two decent pars there they're tough holes and then I birdied 15. It was a great birdie. I was really happy with it. Come on to the par 5 here. 
and somehow I get one of the worst bounces of all time coming up this hill. Uh, it's not even a difficult par 5, really. And it just bounces all the way down off the hill and out of bounds. And now I'm putting for a 7. This is for a goddamn 7. That's a double bogey, by the way. Finishing a par on my second ball. Um, I'm literally so angry. Like, it was a flawless round up until this point. It was so fucking good. Like, I was really happy with it. I should be 10 under at Next worst right happened. now. Four at worst! Three? Let's see what happens. It's so annoying. Like, I'd be up near the top of the leaderboard. Some shit like this always happens to me, though. Like, always. I can never just have a nice drama-free round. Like, a good round. I think that's the four Some iron. shit like that double bogey always has and to happen. It's definitely heading towards the green. That's too far. I don't even care about the rest of the round now. Like, I'm honestly done. I'm just completely done. I'm so upset. That's that's really going to stay up there, huh? Wow. Okay. It's not even going to come back down. And this for the birdie. Give it a little tap, tap, tap a -roo. Really? Okay. Oh, my goodness. That was close. Okay. I'm just done, honestly. And about five feet to go here. Glad this round is coming to a close. And that putt drops on in for par. We did well. We have to we have to give ourselves a pat on the back. That front nine was something special, but that one double bogey, that one hole, it's always that one hole that just ruins it for me. And it's the same thing that always happens. That's why I'm so upset about it. Like, it always happens. It's not like it's a one-time thing or just a kind of common occurrence. It's literally all the time that shit happens. That is some drive. Good lord. It's going to be a 400 yarder. Come back in there, baby. It is a 400 yarder. 405 yards. Yeah. And I am pretty sure he's going to like that. It's a par four, by From the way. Here, about 230 yards to the pin. Okay, 230 yards to the pin. Oh, no, I hit it fast. That's out of bounds. Genuinely. Yep. <laughs> oh, fucking and funny. unfortunately, he's ended up out of bounds on that one. That's fucking funny, dude. I'm just hitting it again. I genuinely don't care now at this point. I hit it fast again? Yeah, that couldn't have happened the first time, no? <laughs> Like, come on, bro. <laughs> like, that was luck. But there's no point in being lucky right after you're unlucky, because the green. Yeah, round is done time. now. It's Final another bogey. Of 65. It's another bogey, and it's a 7-under round when it should be at least an 11, 12-under kind of round. That, that was on course to be one of my best rounds in a long time, honestly. And that ending has completely fucked us. Uh, hopefully, you guys enjoyed the video regardless. I know. My rounds always have some share of fucking drama. This guy had a 59. That should have been us. Cricket Gus, the South African. That should have been us. It should have been us. But hopefully you guys enjoyed it regardless. And uh, we'll be back next week for another fantasy course of the week. And I hope to see you all then. It's been my pleasure to serve you. Peace out. Yeah.